What is good? Diamond Dynasty. Oh. <clears throat> Let's try that again. What is good? Diamond Dynasty, baby. Y'all already know what's going on in this video today. We're going to be doing this reaction video. Shout out to Miss Kim from Voice for the People React. Make sure if you have not already and you're new to the channel, make sure that you like this video up. Comment, subscribe to the motherfucking channel. Make sure you hit that bell so you can be notified every time I post another lit ass video. Make sure that you DM me at the Diamond Life 888, man. Let me know what I should be reacting to next. And tell a friend and tell a friend and tell their angel mama, tell their uncle Joe, he's still a hoe. Let's get right into this video. Also, make sure you go cop your merch. You will see it right underneath this video. Also, in the pinned comment down below. Let's get into this video, man. Let's go. Like reacts because he just posted up a video confirming that he's back with his ex-girlfriend, Treya. Which a lot of get- And Flight gets back with these chicks and wonder why these chicks treat them like shit. They already seen that, oh, I treated this nigga like shit. Horse shit, dog shit. And he still came his ass back. Like a little puppy dog. Oh, okay, I love, I take it back, I take it back. No, bitch, no, it's none of that, all right? So that's why I say, man, Flight talks a good game, but he can't back it up. And I have so much love for Flight, and I wanna see him be happy with somebody. But you can't tolerate disrespect. You can't, you have to have a fucking backbone. You gotta have a spine, man. You have to, or you're gonna get steamrolled the fuck over. All right? I'm just saying. Gamers from his community had a lot to say about him returning to quote unquote crazy Drea. Now I can't Do you though? hold the response. Do you? This one is my favorite. I felt like Reese was saying exactly what I wanted to say because when I say it, people get upset. So mm. okay, Reese. <laughs> Are me and Andrea, you know what I'm saying, back together? The question is, yes. We're working shit out, you know what I'm saying? What are you gonna do about it? I'm gonna be Very. disappointed. That's exactly Very. what I'm gonna do about it. I thought you would have had more common sense than this IQ is dirty low. thing you call a do rag. <laughs> Hello! Did you not see what she did? Do rag too, that, too goddamn tight. You threw the police at your door. Bruh. Not only that, if it wasn't for what happened last year, that whole situation would have went all the way left. A woman is screaming to the top of her lungs, bloody murder in your apartment. Why would have been on a flyer? Turning off the stream, touching your personal property. You said if she touches your personal property, she doesn't have respect mm. for you. All of this. So he doesn't care. She got the respect he doesn't care. Looking for. Are right. you out of your mind? You said yes, we're he is. Be kings all kings. Yes, he is. You say we're gonna boss up. We're gonna see ourselves how we just. What I just say? What I just said, he talks a good game. Once again, he can't back it up. He never backs it up. All right? You can talk all you want, but ladies out there, right or wrong, y'all are about action, right? A nigga can talk a good game all he want, but can he back it up? Ladies, let me know in the comment section down below, right or wrong. A nigga can talk a good game, but when it come down to it, he gonna have to show you some. Okay? That's just what it is. That's what it boils down to, guys. And Flight has a lot of talk, but no action. Alright? It just sounds good. Deserve to be deserved. <clears throat> Treat it. I get it. He said so much BS you can't keep up. Okay. I don't know you said it, not me. So now you want to sit here and act like you don't know Nothing. what's going on. I'm extremely disappointed. I'm extremely upset. Can you be surprised though? Look what happened to Flight's other ex, his baby moms, bruh. His baby moms. I hate to bring up Ty. Look what happened to Ty. He always getting with these chicks who run his whole fucking life, bruh. He has no sort of motherfucking backbone. Whatever she say goes. And if he wants to be treated like a king, that ain't king mentality, bruh. That's just facts. That what you're saying out of your facts. mouth is up Come on now. asinine, and I have no idea as I'm to what is going on in this video. Flight making a 40-minute video exposing his girlfriend, and now he's talking about why you concerned mm. about my life. Yo That's why I be thinking, maybe Flight knows what he's doing. And he knows niggas gonna tune in for an hour long video, 45 minute long video. It was about his drama, okay? I'm gonna say, what dumb ass shit did Flight get himself into this time? They're gonna sit there, they're gonna watch all the ads, they're gonna watch the whole hour long video. They're gonna feel sympathetic and sad for Flight. But at the end of the day, like I said, I can't even be mad at these chicks because he's putting himself in position to get fucked with no lube. 
All right? Just totally punching the ass. Up the ass like this with no lube. All right? So that's not their fault, to be honest. I'm not saying they're right. But you are only around for what you allow. You can only... If you don't tolerate bullshit, bullshit will not come to you. And if it does come to you, it will get shut the fuck down. All right? And like I said, man, this could all be an act. Flight knows how to get views. Flight obviously knows how to market himself. Maybe this is another ploy. Or maybe he just is capitalizing off of his misfortunes. Either way, I would like to see Flight have some real love in his motherfucking life. But hey, it is what it is. Y'all comment down below. Let me know how you guys feel. Y'all are nobodies. nobodies. <laughs> what? We nobodies. <laughs> you watch you at us. But no, we got you in right. 4K. 4K! 4K! <laughs> 4K. <laughs> you edited the video and hit upload to social media. Mm. Talking about once I tweet out the words, I'm single, right. it's set in stone, and I'll never go back on. But you could tell that that was a lie when he opened the door for the bid. Maury, lie detector said that was a lie, and we knew it. When he said it right in front of her and you let the bitch in. <laughs> All right, guys. You reached out to Bow Wow's old fling. I don't understand how everybody started following me about me posting something on my page. The boy Chris was in. Okay, so Chris said, hey, boo. This girl says, looking eyes. If a girl give you the looking eyes, she even respond with the looking eyes. She probably in some shape or form interested. Not always, but most of the time. Chris said, I said, hey, so why you just staring? What you, oh, <laughs> she said, what you want, boy? He said, I want to take you on a date, dang. Oh, she said, nah, I'm cool. If that's the case, why write him back, right? Chris said, but you posted our DMs, and everybody is a somebody. That's what's wrong with y'all now. Y'all think y'all bigger than the people that has less of a social status than y'all. No, we all the same, dumb little girl. Whoa. That's why you. That's why your damn ego too big right now. That's exactly why your baby daddy not with your ass. Enjoy. Whoa. Why does Chris get so? Chris be so butt hurt when a bitch don't want to talk to him, bro. Chris, come on, little bro. Like every bitch don't want you. You got to get it through your thick ass skull that every bitch don't want to fuck with Chris Sales, bro. All right. Yes, you're an attractive, handsome young man. Absolutely. However, that don't mean these bitches want your ass. Not every bitch wants you. Okay. <laughs> I'm just saying. So she says, boy, LMAO, you do not know me. I breathe the same air as my baby daddy 24-7. I posted it because it's a fucking joke. You know how many DMs you be in every day? Facts. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Excuse me. Like, all of my friends are clowning you. It's not even as serious. Don't act like you know me. We are not the same. I'm cut from a different motherfucking claw. You cannot touch me. You cannot see me. I'm up here. You down there. Anyway, guys, let's see what she got to say. <laughs> even following me when I posted the DM, it's a joke. Like, it was an insider between me and my homegirls. Everybody knows he's in everybody's DM. Mm -hmm. It's nothing new. And you're a stalker at this point. Period. Y'all ain't get it, whatever. No, so, he's a lion, he's a square, he's a woman. Ooh. They went there. Oh, they went there. Why are you doing that? Cheat. I have to be with you to cheat. Now I already saw this coming, but 23KB confirmed him and Tay are no longer together. Here's what he had to say. That's why I'm keeping my heart to myself. Nigga, get the fuck out of here. Talking about you keeping your heart to yourself, bruh. If I'm giving anything away, it's gonna be some more. Now, I told y'all in the previous video that Nick and Fredo Bay was hanging. To me, at the end of the day, that 23KB, he just wanted to be seen with, um, with Tay ass. Okay, that's just my opinion. And how fast they was moving and shit, it was very clear that that shit probably wasn't gonna last. All right, but they're young and they're getting it. They're in their prime. They're having a good time. And that's what it's all about, right? And now it was recently his Look birthday. And she went all out for his birthday. She was spending time with him. So this is really a thing, mm -hmm. okay? We're doing birthdays now. Y'all yeah. think comments down below? Look hey, I wish the best for Fredo. I wish the best for Nick. King as well. At the end of the day, let's just be happy, man. Let's just fucking be happy. You got a choice in every single second and moment in time to be happy, bro. You don't know when you're gonna take your last breath. Why use your motherfucking last breath to be depressed? 
or to be sad about some shit, nigga. You're not the first person to struggle. You won't be the last. And you weren't the first person who went through a situation and was able to grow from it and be better and change their circumstances, okay? It all starts with you. It all starts with how you feel. It all starts with the thoughts that you are creating throughout the day. But anyway, guys, I love you guys so much. I will see y'all in the next one. I hope you guys have a great motherfucking Friday, a good Friday, a great Friday, all of that, an awesome Friday. And yeah, man, make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend to the angel, mama, tenant, uncle Joe, he's still a hoe. I will see you guys in the next motherfucking video. I love y'all, man. Peace. We out, baby.